Wait, so our new professor is you? I didn't see that one coming. Easy, Caspar. <laughs> Aren't you being a bit rude? Yeah, do you know Dorothea, like, holds, she's the, the, she's the, the, um, the high chair of the, the breakdancing club. She owns a lot of flattened cardboard boxes. You know it's a waste of time to expect politeness from him. It will be a pleasure learning from you, Professor. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm off to take a nap. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> don't look at me like that! Oh, and please don't talk to me too much either. Is this just straight up Gwen? Gwen, I know you left, but this is you, right? <laughs> <sighs> I'm sorry for the chaos you've walked into. I hear we are rather close in age, Professor. I hope you do not mind if we treat you like one of us. I do, actually, um, because I'm the professor, so... You can, no. <sighs> in our class, we try to treat each other as equals, despite any differences in age No, you status. probably should continue doing that, but, like, I'm in charge. Personally, I would love to include you in that inner circle. <laughs> Why? Why is this even, this is even faker than the other fake choice? <laughs> Why? Why would you make this an option? You have a gut, Professor. I will take great... <laughs> that was rude. It's a rude observation. <laughs> And then I accidentally pressed the start button, so we skipped that whole thing. <laughs> you have a gut, Professor. <laughs> like, hey, come on now, listen. <laughs> Rude. There are new places to explore in the monastery. We got a thousand G to fund the services for this month. And now it's the 26th. All right. Say, while you're here, I'd like to use this device I designed to determine whether the power of a crest resides within you. Won't hurt a bit. Promise. I don't trust this guy. You don't know about crests? Well, allow me to tell you everything. Absolutely everything about them. Is your calendar clear? This will take a while. Crests are a fascinating topic. But before one can dive deeply into said topic, one must first understand what crests are. They are power incarnate. <laughs> they are said to have been bestowed upon humans by the goddess countless ages ago. They exist within the flesh and are passed down through bloodlines. If you ask me, modern science peaked in 1890. <laughs> Those who carry crests Bully. may excel at magic, display exceptional strength or any number of boons each crest has its own i couldn't power, help but notice your boons beyond mortal understanding for now i suspect as much yes but we won't know for sure unless i look into the matter as i said crests are passed down through the blood well, I have you, milady. Let me tell you about the works of Quentin Tarantino. However, just because someone carries a crest does not necessarily... It is kind of like a dragon mark, yeah. ...will inherit it as well. <laughs> Only a scarce up, Zachary? few Welcome descendants back. of a crest's bloodline end up inheriting that crest's power. Perhaps one of your ancestors bore a crest, and you just happened to inherit it. That is how a crest usually presents itself. <laughs> Four all. out of five dentists suggest a crest. Yeah, do what you can to find out. Yes, of course. I'll get to the bottom of it straight away. Now then, please go ahead and hold out your arm over this device here. Oh my god, the device is actually to check, like, my lineage. What is this? A pattern I've never seen before. Is it possible an as yet undiscovered crest has been detected? To think, there are still crests out there that even I am unaware of. How thrilling! <clears throat> 
Pardon my unrestrained. Somebody give this guy a wedgie. I have much to consider. You may leave now. I have more research to do in regard to this crest. Yes, so very much more research. <laughs> oh my god, get out of here, nerd. What could this be? No, get out of here. <laughs> really, that's all I did on the 26th. Okay. All right. It's F day, the 27th. It's F day, everybody. Happy F day. Professors of the Officers Academy receive a schedule for the month ahead. It notes the days on which events and missions will take place that month. Pay careful attention to your schedule. The monastery schedule will feature different events on different days. Each week you'll have one day off. You choose an act this is so Japan. <laughs> Each week you'll have one day off, which you must use to go to school. But it's a different kind of school than the regular school you have to go to the other six days of the week. Uh, your only option first will be explore. Select the calendar with the directional buttons to view the schedule. Alright, so F day here. Um we got going on uh there's like different holidays and stuff and like people's birthdays and stuff cool house rivalry battle and ferdinand's birthday but today share a meal gardening fishing all right it's your first day off but i have all these scheduled plans what am i getting ferdinand for his birthday well first an assassination attempt and then another assassination attempt would you like to explore? It's my only option, so I'd love to. I thought I heard a girl's voice, but I must have been imagining things. Can I decorate my room? Please assist me by catching a delectable fish for the Saint Sethlean celebration. I'd like some help growing vegetables. Ah, uh, it's to do. And then. Sylvain, the food in the dining hall is pretty appetizing. Anyone interested in sharing a meal? Ladies preferred. Fuck off. Ugh. Gross. So, these are the students' quarters. To better help you supervise them, you also have a room here. Your room is here at the end. The room I just came out of. Commoner students also reside on the first floor. While the second is primarily for students of noble birth. So damn. As a rule, we try to avoid discrimination based on social status here. But <laughs> you don't try very can hard. Be quite insistent when it comes to matters of propriety. Speaking of, it would be best for you to avoid improper conduct. I expect you to set a good example for the students. <laughs> we don't segregate our students except by class okay. and the country they come from. Too keen on the professor. Oh, you don't have a name. You're nobody. Don't talk to me. So. Is that a doggo? Professor. Lesbian. Just a second. I gotta come back. Ooh, look at this doggo. Okay. Some believe the dignity of the Empire rests on the results of the mock battle. That's an overstatement, of course. Still, we must do our best to prevail. Agreed. You should take the time to learn each student's abilities. You look as if you have no idea what's going on here. I know my way around, so I'm happy to help you find your footing. Could you help me off my feet? Oh my god. The monastery has some exceptional facilities that everyone who lives at the Officers Academy is welcome to make use of. For example, you can enjoy a meal with your students at the dining hall, or take part in some one-on-one -on -one sparring at the training grounds. I suggest visiting the various facilities whenever you have the time to spare. Have you noticed the bulletin boards placed around the monastery? Those contain requests people have posted, as well as helpful information from the market. If you prove yourself by helping people with their requests, certain facilities here will become available for your use. The bulletin board is updated frequently, so you should take your time when speaking with everyone. But when it comes to using the facilities, well, you need to be more careful about that. Never mind. <laughs> if you use them without planning ahead, your free time will be gone before you know it. Don't spend all day in the crapper. 
You can explore the monastery as much as you like. Certain availability, certain abilities, ugh, activities are available when you have points. All right. A great deal is expected from professors of the Officers Academy, so it's important to hone your skills. To put it plainly, you'll need to keep expanding your knowledge of all disciplines, not just battle. Read books, take part in activities, and interact with students. Dimitri and Claude are the leaders of the other two houses. Do not underestimate them. When we take the field, it would be best not to engage the both of them at once. Listen to this. Wow, Yuritsa sure seems strong. I kind of thought he was going to be the new professor assigned to our class. After that teacher ran away during our outdoor training, I figured Yuritsa was a natural replacement. I was surprised this guy's got such an anime protagonist instead. voice. I don't think I could hold my own against Yuritsa in battle. I could probably take you though. You little fucker. You really think so? With enough training, I'm sure I'll beat you someday. Are you obsessing over Yuritsa? What? I care nothing of friendship. <laughs> what? Who? What? Who the fuck is this? Jesus! You just dress like this every day? You friggin' try hard? Well, we found Illidan! If you have no business here, leave. <laughs> Favorite game? Yeah, Dark Souls PvP. I care if you have. This is this outfit. Hello. Oh, I'm an E level oh. professor. You're all nobody. I don't need to talk to any of you. What's up, girl? Hi, professor. How are you doing? If you're not busy, would you like to join me on a little trip into town? Why? I think I'd love up to. In this dusty old monastery for too long. It drives me absolutely crazy. If you're, if I'm I mean, I thought we were gonna. Oh, whatever. I guess I'll just go explore and talk to everybody. Before I came to the Officers Academy, I attended a school of magic in the Kingdom Capital. In the Kingdom Capital. That's where I met Annie. That's what I call Annette. Oh, I guess Lawrence was at the school of magic too. But Annie was always just so nice to me, even though I was older. She's my best friend in the world. Oh, what a soft lady. Where's Ingrid? Ingrid, what up? The, story. the Blue Lion House derived its name from the honorary title of the first king of Fargus. Lug, the king Lug. of lions, wore brilliantly blue garments. King Lug. His exploits are recorded in multiple legends. Okay, it's King Lug. The library holds various historical accounts regarding him and the Blue Lions. <laughs> right, and his... And his glorious armada, time, the Lugies. You read them. I don't care about your dumb house. Hey, it's King Lug. Like, why not just spell it L U G H? Hi. Our house is that of the Golden Deer. Do you know the significance of that name, Professor? Golden Deer are sacred creatures said to have protected Lester since time immemorial. All three of the houses have a meaning behind their name. You should feel free to ask around if that sort of knowledge interests you. Luke Skywalker. <laughs> Remember me? I'm Ignax. This is the Golden Deer House. You're in charge of a different class, right? Yes, I'm in charge of Robot House. Too bad we won't see more of each other. I'm happy to learn from you if the opportunity comes up. Bye. <laughs> Professor Sanic. On the move. Listen. Let me tell you the provenance of our class name. The Eagle. That refers to the twin-headed eagle on the Adrestian Empire's coat of arms. <laughs> and black is the traditional color of the Empire's armor. Hence, black eagles. <laughs> Great. That's a good story. The significance is the eagle is significant. And it's black because black is important. Also, yeah, are we Poland? I think we're Poland. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> I'm going to Area 
area 51. Did we do we get everybody? Did we talk to everyone already? Right, right. Yeah, we did. Oh. Zoing. Listen. I should probably be praying. <gasps> the amiibo gazebo. <laughs> You can scan an amiibo here. Certain items appear randomly in the monastery. You get higher quality items for... I don't have any amiibos for the amiibo gazebo. I own zero amiibos. So it's a useless gazebo to me. It is a great name though. Another cat. There goes that Professor Sanic again. having great abilities for reading and writing. With sadness, I still have struggles with speaking. If my ways of speak, uh, uh, of speech are causing a burden, I hope you will have forgiveness. Professor, if my way- okay, okay. Ah, yes, the bulletin board. Now, can I do all three of these today, or is it gonna- I have to pick one? Because I, I only have, like, what, one action point? What if I have to go to the facilities? Hello there, Professor. I can do them all, okay. Well, I call Thank you, you that, but I am afraid I am not a student here myself. Where can I visit you, then? My brother would not be pleased if he heard you saying such things. I mean, I just- The monastery is kind enough to provide a sanctuary for my wow, brother- Wow, called and out. He's the only family I have. I just wanted to hang out. Damn. Might you help me with a favor? Yeah, see, she wants to hang out. We gotta go fishing. Damn, kid. It's you. I'm busy. Do you want something? No. Then get out of my way. Wow, Felix! Asshole! Ugh, I really need to eat. I can't hold out until the next meal. Look at his little face. Aw, little guy. Why can't the dining hall stay open all the time? I need to keep eating if I want to get stronger. Yeah, there's food right there. Just fucking jam it in your mouth. Also, you need a new shirt, honey. It's a weird look. Share a meal has not been unlocked. Okay. Here, let's go. Let's go fishing. That was weird. Oh, it just teleported me to the quest. Okay. <laughs> I was like, uh, what? Just teleported to the room I was standing in. What's up, fish keeper? <laughs> fish keeper, I need your strongest fish. I am going on a quest. <laughs> to begin fishing, select your bait. Wait till you see the swil silhouette of the fish you want to catch. Press A. Oh boy. You want to overlap, reduce the stamina. Once it's depleted, you catch the fish. If your line breaks, it escapes. Okay, let's do it. Let's try it. Fool, you can't handle my strongest fishes. Bite all. Fuck yeah, I love this mini game. Ooh, a Caracius. Now I gotta go take it to the owl, right? Yeah, yeah, J, J Rocka. So the, the game, I'm playing it on the Switch, and then I split the signal. One goes into my streaming PC, and one goes to my monitor. So I can see it while I'm streaming it. Yep. Um, well, I caught a fish, so let's go and... You have helped me so much. So I gave her a fish, and she gave me back six fishes and five bait. Okay, good. All right. And some renown, which is maybe the most important bit. Ugh, can we go fishing again? I'd love to fish in the pond. Come on and get in the boat. Fish, come on and get in the boat. Fish, fish. Oh, yeah. 
An Albinian herring. That'd be easier to catch if I had a herring aid. <laughs> See, she didn't like the joke either. God, that sound is so fucking satisfying. Blammo! Ooh, glittering gold. This fish boasts a high cost. Man, I'm good at this. What's up, man? How, where do I sell my fish? Who wants to buy a fish? Goddess, goddess, I pray to thee. Please protect us. Blue Jay? <sighs> okay. Bye. Hmm. I love this time of year. Cyril? Let's see, I'm a little busy. How dare you speak to me like that? Can't we just talk a little, Cyril? I really can't right now. I got a lot of things to do. Work and stuff like that. Why don't you look at the flowers in the greenhouse instead? They're pretty. Damn, Cyril. You, f you fucking urchin. I love it. The sass mouth on that kid. <sighs> the great tree moon is the best time of the year for naps. He kind of looks like Tiny Tim. I could just forget all about my assignment. Now I'm feeling Hello. sleepy too. Anyway. Oh, did you come to look at the plants too? The greenhouse here is really incredible. It really sounds like there's some kind of voice modulator on Ash's voice. There are so many rare flowers I'd never seen back home, and herbs I never even knew existed. You seem well informed on My this adoptive subject. father is the real expert. He taught me everything I know about herbs, including how to tell them apart and how to make medicines. I know a thing or two about herbs. You should try looking around the greenhouse sometime. That gardening has not been unlocked. All right. So we can do fishing. We can do gardening. Oh, I should go take another quest, right? Oh, I'm in the middle of something. say like the textures and the like environments could be better like I don't know Hi there. you know like everything looks so like blocky and kind of game cubey um okay green thumb beginnings let's go help to do Up to do. Let me know when you are hungry. I'm hungry now. I will make you a quality meal as thanks for your service to his highness. I love you to do. Feed me. I have a request. You need a certain vegetable. It's called a tomato. Uh, let's go get it. <laughs> I heard about the upcoming mock battle. Goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness. Okay, we're gonna go to the greenhouse. Hi. Hey, Teach. I hear there's gonna be a mock battle between the houses. It's a parabolic. Thank you. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a bit concerned about facing an elite mercenary like you. Mm, take it easy on me. Oh, Don't take it easy on me. Have you adjusted to life at the academy yet? Me? I'm still not used to it. I'm not one for all this studying and training. Yeah, like, I mean, this is pretty normal for these games, like it being sort of slice of lifey and... I'm Captain Jay's first and best apprentice. I can beat anyone, Professor. Even you, if I have to. It may have been only for a short time, but I learned from the absolute best. I'm trying to get to the greenhouse. Right. Oh. Well, there's Dorothea, Hilda, and Mercedes. Lady Rhea is quite the beauty, too. And I must admit, I've even checked out Professor Manuela once or twice. I hate you. You know, Professor, I think I'm going to like it at the Officer's Academy. There are beautiful girls as far as the eye can see. <laughs> Fuck you. Wait. Well, you know, go prof her. Professor, I've got oh, a small okay. favor to ask. I thought this was gonna be a gross quest, but it's not. It's just how to do cooking. God, this fucking guy. Hey. Okay. Uh, the greenhouse is like in the middle of the. Oh. The cat or that lady? <laughs> Let me 
Nah, no, no, it's not this way. Where the hell am I going? Okay, whatever. Hi. Today's special. Sagart and Cream. Select the first person you'd like to share a meal with. Ah, uh, Dorothea. Is he our Yancey? He is. Then... Oh wait, no. Edgelord, then Dorothea. Uh, Edgelord and Dorothea. Sorry, Bernadetta, you don't like people anyway. What's up, ladies? Oh, I love this meal. How did you know? I've been following you on Instagram for some time. I think I like this, but it's been a while, so I'm not sure. Yes! Food bonds. Hell yeah, I'm an E plus level professor. Feels good. You'll usually want to finish exploring the direct duty points run out. Press the L button to do so. Okay. Nice. I knew I could count on you. Okay. Now, greenhouse. You'll get tenure in no time. Yeah, right. Okay, where was the, where's the greenhouse at? Oh. Let me see. <laughs> oh. Listen. Um. What the? Somewhere around here, there, there it is. I'm gonna go fishing again. <laughs> fishing just feels so good. I'd love to fish in the pond. Let's do it. What are we gonna get? Vital. Oh, so satisfying. A Caledonian gar. Yeah, we just fish out of the moat, I guess. Okay. Yeah, it's like, it's a turn-based strategy game, but there's all of this, like, building your characters, like, interactions with each other, and there's a lot. All right, let's garden. Harvest all kind of crops. Flowers make great gifts. Some people might even decorate their room with the flower you give them. Ooh. Use the plant command to figure out what seeds to use. More seeds mean a bigger harvest. More compatible seeds, higher quality. Cultivate, you pay the greenhouse keeper to look after your crop. The more you spend, the better your harvest will be. Okay, it'll be ready a week after you plant the seeds. Let's do it. I only have to do seeds. So we'll plant, plant those. There you go. And then I will give you money. Here, pour air mid water. Okay. My thanks. Yeah, no problem, man. Can I plant can I plant some more while we're here? No. Okay, so I've already got Dedu's seeds planted. You can't grow plants without a little Dedu. No. You know, for fertilizer? <laughs> All right, I think we're done. I'm done all the quests, so let's find the stairs and go talk to some more people upstairs. Yes. This is the wrong direction. Also, I feel like Bernadetta is around somewhere and we need to hassle her. Right, it shows you who you have and haven't talked to yet. In case you're looking for people. Hey Zev. How you doing? Hmm. How early in the game is it? Like quite early. Oh hey. I'm stealing things from the supply boxes. Yeah, we're only a couple hours in. Um okay. Let me look at my map again. Yeah, I want to keep going this direction and then go left. Past the amiibo gazebo. All right. Greetings, professor. Nothing to report. 
By the by, have you ever regretted a decision and wished you could go back and undo it? It's too bad there's no lesson for how to turn back the old clock, huh? Why? Why would you say that? 